clear off the station. This is another reading that somebody didn't pay me for. I find this very uh, fun, to be honest with you. Uh, things aren't always what they seem. We have uh, board and hemlock. Uh, I would look up hemlock in the little flower language thing. You want to take a look at that. We also have a basket of Easter eggs, which I find is interesting too. Easter was March, I think. Yeah, March. So I get I have to collect all my cards. All right. Uh, okay. I think I have enough cards for right now. Um, We have chain. We have chain of events that will affect your life. We have haystack. Uh, karma, you will reap what you have sown. We have older man. We have dealings or relationship with an older man. We have cracked cup, dissatisfaction with life. We have a seahorse, family matters. We have fair woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair. We have rooster. We have an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. We have clouds. We have temporary problems. We have bridge. We have successful, overcoming a problem. We have a parrot. We have somebody will be gossiping about your secrets. We have teapot. We have deep friendship or with somebody of the uh, same sex. We have a spear. We have heartache over what you no longer have. We have older woman dealings or relationships with an older woman. We have a ram. We have a stubborn, aggressive person. We have diamond. You will receive or be getting a precious gift. We have valley. We have deep personal strength and peace that assures success. We have well, we have family wishes come true. We have bird perched, we have waiting for news packages, uh, a letter. So we have a door, opportunities are waiting for you. We have dog far away, we have a distant friend is thinking about you. We have a skull, we have hidden secrets, can harm you. Uh, we have climbing towards success. We have honor and respect will come to you. We have September. That can be somebody's birthday or an event. We have acts. We have forces working against you. We have scales keeping your life in balance. All right, let's see what's going on with this reading. We have masquerade. What appears to be going on. Okay, so we have unsure about your partner. The wheels start turning and change and movement. Uh, number two, we have goblin. We have re re reveals the hidden aspect of the situation. Um, so we have empty void feeling dead inside in general. Um, let's see. Alright, so we have depression, excessive demands from others, opportunity to start again and again. Okay, and then we have wisdom. 
thing that you keep on your mind handling a situation. So we have depression taking over. So journey, uh, determination, willingness, success, discipline, and action. All right, and then we have uh, money, which is interesting. Um, so rejection. So we have delay, domestic problems, family problems, stuck, fam, energy. Okay, and then we have um, career, which is uh, rejection as well. So rushing, recklessness, uh moving uh, forward, forgetting, letting go, career success. Um, it turns to career loss. And then we have love. So love's an interesting one too. There's bad habits here. So extreme or emotions carried away by own thoughts, several um, sexual attractions, self-protection is needed, reflection, ebb and flow, unseen, um, hidden, habitual obsession, or habitual liar. All right, so you can imagine who, who asked for this reading. But yeah, this, this reading is very hard because it does talk about things that usually a tarot reader would talk about, but it talks about it in such a way where it talks about even the mask that you're wearing and what type of motivation you have for wearing this mask, which can be unsettling for some people, but for tarot readers, it's like, we already know, dude. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it, it can be an eye opener to know that there's some people that have bad intentions or they have intentions of just spying on somebody and maybe to their face as well so they could be lying to somebody's face but um being loyal to like somebody who is an enemy of theirs or something anyway hopefully this helped you out in some way shape or form and watch your back you know it's, it's a weird energy but it's for entertainment purposes because people don't pay me and this is a dollar reading a dollar literally one one simoleon um nothing too big nothing too small it's just it's just a dollar reading and some people can't even pay a dollar now it's kind of weird but it is for entertainment purposes and hopefully you learn something so hopefully you know if you are a tarot reader you put this in your readings as a clearance for your own you know stuff it, it helps it helps to do readings like this that are kind of off the scale of normal and kind of looks into like people's motivations as well anyway i will see you in the next reading you take care of yourselves all right later